So one of the things we can do with a robot, we can effectively do a survey or collect data in a hazardous environment. It can work close to hazardous machinery. It can work close to an edge that's unprotected. It can even work in an atmosphere that hasn't got good um, air quality content. So we can enable us to do tasks which would previously have taken quite considerable effort. It also frees up people to do more value-added activities. When we're just collecting data, it's not really a meaningful task. Our people are better employed looking at the data and making decisions on it. One of the guys uh, who heads up the team is based over in Finland and we've successfully undertaken a remote control of the robot from his base over in Finland and the robot is based on our construction site in Shetland. He can see what the robot can see because we've installed a, an additional camera onto the hardware um, and it's, uh, it opens up the possibilities of people being able to do tasks remote from the job site so they can maybe work on several different projects in the same day if we've got robots deployed on those different sites. Unfortunately, since the robot's been introduced, everyone just likes to stop and stare at it because it creates such an interest. Um, however, we, we're getting over that. It's generally been accepted as just another work tool that's on the site. Yeah.